Splatcade! Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Metroid Zero Mission. Wrong direction. Really? We just we said we were going to figure out what to do, and the first thing you do is mess up. You are a disappointment to this entire group. I could be you. What do you mean you could be me? What is that supposed to mean? You're the biggest disappointment. <sighs> you know, I, I have to say I respect you a lot for that. No one else is as big a man. Did you really solve the puzzle already? Yes. Oh yeah, that's right, because like, we, we looked up what to do on... Uh, no, actually... Uh, we didn't. I figured it out before you could look it up. That's you right. You a dirty cheater. I am uh, not uh, a cheater. Uh... Oh, that's cool. You've solved one puzzle only to fail entirely on another. No. What did you do? Gavin. What? Uh, how, did you make, how did you beast. make them attack? Are you using yourself as bait? I didn't, like, okay, then tell me this. How is it that we can't destroy these little things, but those little bugs can? That just makes them even scarier now. It like, probably dissolve them with stomach juices. They're probably just eating it. Get off, get off, get off, right? As I said, dissolving them with stomach juices. That's in. Okay, uh, well, cool, we finally, well, first one, the first one we did on purpose, the second one we did on accident. You better not do that. No, actually, you're, you're good. You're good. You go there. Go there. Uh, you had a couple stories that you wanted to tell me before we actually started recording. We said we were going to save it for uh, for when we actually started the session. So the main one about it was. Shut up. I was going to tell you about what my grandmother calls a horse cock sandwich. Uh, that 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 never came up. What are you talking about? That's because we cut. The conversation beforehand so that we could, you know, <laughs> this is news. Save it for this. You said you were going to talk about horse dicks, I know that, but you never said anything about a horse cock sandwich. That would be bologna. What? Have you ever eaten bologna? Yeah, I mean, I've eaten bologna like a couple times. Have you ever noticed how circular and uh, um, right around the where, side where of the horse Where are you going with this? Have you ever noticed that? It's right around the size of a horse dick. How do you know what a horse dick looks like? I'm like, not a brony. Answer <laughs> that question. What do you know what a, how, like, how do you know what a real horse dick looks like? It's not, Reasons. It's not all that hard. Oh, I see. Now we're now we're just using little aliens as slaves. Pretty much. And then afterwards, once their uses are filled. Oh yeah. Okay, cool. And then 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 they're dead. Sweet. And I actually, while I was looking up the walk, trying to look up the walkthrough for this, I actually found that mistake that it's not called the Chozo suit, like I've been calling it for the past twelve episodes. No, yeah, but it's I wanna smack you. it's the uh, Varia suit, which decreases damage taken from enemies, prevents damage from acid and heat, which you're going to adore now. Look, check out this costume change if they do it. No, was it? In okay, cool. Never mind. Uh, it changed. It changed. Like the they changed the tint. Of some of the pieces of it, yeah, yeah. Still Which I knew, I knew not you were gonna love because all you do in this playthrough is apparently jump into lava. Lava's warm and beautiful. Yeah, you have a big affinity for that, that's for sure. Cool. So now we can walk in here, no problem. Energy tank. Find a way to get down there. Like I, I can't help but think, like anytime you jump underwater or I guess under lava, I can't help but think. Copyright strike. No, that shit's way too old for copyright. At least I hope so. Oh, there you go. Watch just the endless abyss. Oh, cool. So we just gotta dig through. Uh, I mean, another interesting thing that came up today, besides all the technical issues that are too annoying to talk about, by your own admission at the time of this current recording, you have been unable to take a shower. Yes, it's been uh, it's been two days. Two days. And I'm I'm trying to slip my wrists as we talk. <laughs> uh, and uh, like w like, what's the reason like why you couldn't like why why haven't you been able to take a shower besides like laziness and apathy for others? Uh, my septic tank popped. Was it your fault? I'm pretty sure it was your fault. My and my stepfather's. Oh, so I will you, never so take so full you, fault. So I will you never take, take the full fault. But I do take some, yes. Because I do deserve some. 
Yeah, because like, cause you have one of those like older houses that have like the subject thing actually like built in, right? Yep. Yeah, so like, uh, like did it just like, like, how did you know it popped? Like, was it, is there like a sound or a noise or like, how does it, how do you know? Because there's shit coming out of your wall. <laughs> <laughs> no, but there's a... Oh, we gotta like, somehow get in there to blow up the... Can you throw another bomb? Blow it up. So we know what to do. We need to get those little bastards. Oh, maybe you could like just blow up like on one, just one end, and uh, like roll over there before it like crumbles beneath you. Can you like can you grab the ledge? There you go, and just roll over. No, is that not a thing we can do? No, they won't. Oh, I I know what you're trying to you're trying to stick them to you and then like feed feed it to the. Uh, Feed it to the machine, man. Yep. We should probably save. Oh yeah, definitely, because we, we figured out what to do. I'll be honest with you guys watching, we actually figured that one out. Kind of accident, we were just bored before the recording, we were just like shooting up at the ceiling. Yeah, let's see what happens, and then Josh found it. I'm a smarty. Yeah, you're lucky, uh, I'd say that. Yeah, I, I wouldn't call myself smart either. Oh, and then, uh... The, Ooh, I forgot. Oh yeah, the, the one thing I wanted to bring up too, like, because we, we have so much to talk about now, like, because it's been a couple days between sessions, and uh, one thing, oh yeah, we can go down here now. One thing, that, how the fuck are we gonna get bugs down here? There's gotta be an upgrade we get later that lets us destroy them without outside help. Yeah. But uh, one thing I wanted to bring up too. Whoa, hold on. Whoa. What'd you do, David? Nothing. It, it's freaking out on us for whatever reason. Yes, we are. It, it's exposed. We're using an emulator because obviously we can't. Well, there's no. I don't think there's any cable that exists that lets us. Record like rip a uh, Game Boy game straight off of it. Wait, can you grab those little guys and bring them down through the lava? You can. Sweet. And they like that. They like they like that little thingy more than they like us. And they're impervious to lava. That's great to know. Uh, but there, like, there's a couple stuff, uh, a couple things I wanted to bring up too. I actually recently got these. Uh, like, you remember how I was talking about AX a couple days ago? Like, uh, like I said, we were recording? I, how you were in Utah while I was, well, you were supposed to be in Utah yeah, while I was in AX. Yeah, Anime Expo. There you Please go. Please use the actual term, otherwise I'll fucking not <laughs> understand anything you have to say. Okay, I was at Anime Expo while, while you, at the same time that you were supposed to be at, in Utah. Well, you were in Utah, but you were much longer. We already covered that. Uh, and I actually ordered some shoes through Anime Expo, because there was a little booth there that like did custom orders. So I actually like picked up. I, I ordered a pair of shoes with some characters on it, and they actually came in today. And I was I was super hyped because the design came out really well done. Because I like their like they have a very particular art style that I liked a lot, and they actually came in. And I opened it and I was like, oh, this is super cool. This is maybe not what that I was. That was the luckiest fucking thing I've ever done. Yeah, that's for damn sure. That's why I stopped talking. I was like, whoa, he, he really just nailed that. I really wasn't excited. It was like he just fall through, maybe get hit by the flying cockroach or something like that. There must be balance. You can't be super lucky and then just escape unscathed. You have to pay for it. I'm like, God. Yeah, sure. But, uh, like, they actually came in today, and they are actually super fucking rad. Right. I, I'm actually wearing them right now, and I want to show you. Oh, wow, you can't even really tell. Shut up. I got a, oh, I got a panty and stocking. Panty and stocking nice. And, and, because I got, I got to give up to all the characters in PSG, also went ahead and got some... Oh, demon. Some, uh, some, some of that demon. And, uh, some of that demon sister. No, Garter Belt is not a demon sister. Garter Belt's the black guy. That thing I don't watch. I don't know anything about it. But uh, how come? I got Penny and Stocking on on one foot, and then I got uh, uh the demon sisters Scanty and D socks on the other one, and the guys did like an amazing job. Uh, I'll probably post something to like Instagram or Twitter to like link to on here. But, uh, you know, it's it's not a plug or anything, I just really, I'm just super hyped because I've been waiting a couple months to get the shoes, actually. Because I put it in back in, like, July, but they got super busy because they got, like, hundreds of orders through. And, like, I texted I texted them, like, uh, I think it was, like, a month after the order, like, I put the order through. And, like, oh, and like, they went, like, oh, yeah, uh, sorry it's been taking so long. We just did not expect to be so successful at Anime Expo. We got literally hundreds of orders for custom shoes. I'm like, okay, yeah, I totally get that. Oh, yeah. I would, if I was there, which I could have been, but I made a bad decision. A terrible to. decision. But uh, 
if I was there, I totally would have gotten something. Yeah, dude, for sure. Like, like, and the cool thing about Anime Expo, even though it is Anime Expo in name, like you can find anything from pretty much anything you're interested in, because Anime Expo, like the people who go there as vendors, they know what's up, because uh, you can find like weapon vendors, and like you can find like 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 there's a, like a professional airsoft company that goes there every year with like an enormous booth set up where you can buy like assault rifles. Like they look, they look like real assault rifles with the BBs. They're airsoft. Uh, I was just getting into trouble with those. <laughs> they got uh, like they've got like swords, uh, both from like fan, like both from anime and video games. They've got like a little bit of everything there. Hell, they've got like stickers, crochet, secret, secret, good secret. I mean, not really worth it, but it's a secret. And you're gonna get killed by these little bats, really? Like, after all we've been through? I've got three tanks. That bat's <laughs> not gonna kill me. <laughs> I don't know, like, we didn't expect those bats to swarm us in the other level, and they killed us. That was funny as hell. I still hate my life. <laughs> you're just like, really, Metroid? That, that's how you're gonna play me? Roll that clip back. Wow. Wow. Are you serious? That's gold. Really, Metroid? That is really? <laughs> that is how you treat me. Yeah, good times. That was that uh, was funny. I remember that area. I'll decide not to go there. Oh yeah? Did we already clear that? did we already clear that area? No. But we did it? We couldn't. Why not? I don't think we did. It, we ended up getting trapped down there or something along those lines. Ew. Uh frame drop. Uh, <laughs> On an emulator, what the fuck? Ow. That's just your fault. This is all your fault. Anyway, uh, yeah, so my shoes came in. I was, I was super hyped up. And uh, uh, there, was, there was another thing I wanted to bring up. Oh, yeah. We also, before the recording actually started, we were talking about uh, sexual tension as children. I, I had none as a child. No, I mean, um, like, recognizing <laughs> it as a kid. Because we, uh, we were talking about, uh, I asked you if you had ever been able to recognize, if you were able to recognize sexual tension as a kid, and you're like, uh, no, I don't think so, I don't think I ever had that experience. I, and I, I was starting to tell you about how I actually found it in Power Rangers, of all things, growing up as a kid. I wasn't turned on by Power Rangers. <laughs> no, that's not what I mean, is. damn it. Um, basically, like, I was, I remember as a kid, like, watching Power Rangers Dino Thunder, and I knew that the, like, th like there's a female bad, bad, there's a, vi there's a villainess in there who's like one of the main, like, main villainesses in the, in the series, right? And her identity is the principal of the school where the Power Rangers are going. And the, the main, the main Power Ranger that... What kind of bullshit is this? Maybe that's... Actually, I don't know. I thought we'd be impervious to that, for sure. Maybe it's, like, heat, like the, the really hot stuff. We, the really hot shut up <laughs> heat the really hot stuff trademark spot cave 2015 but uh you know what that's gonna be our new hot sauce the really hot stuff <clears throat> I command this you drop, drop of drop hot drop sauce, sauce to be really really hot stuff yeah we could totally do that I like it I mean I'm gonna take that hot shot uh, for the uh, for the punishment video uh, when it comes up I think uh, when it, it, it should release probably like Sunday is when that'll go up if everything goes if everything goes according to plan. That's that's what I've been calling it uh, in the Spot K chat that, that uh, the the message group that we have together. I've, I called it. It's like oh yeah, my different punishments are uh, hot shot. Actually, I'm I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna keep quiet on this just so uh, like I don't, I don't spoil what happens. But basically, I've been calling them shot up. Uh, I've been calling it hot shot uh, love letter art project. And uh, Cherry Die is what I've been calling it. And, but, and I don't want to spoil what it is, but uh, you can actually expect Splatcade's first uh, vlog styled. Oh, wait, we can go in the top room now. Oh, but, there's, there's only a rocket pack in there. Never mind. Yeah, I remember we got to the end of that. Yeah, like we, like we wasted like two tanks or something, and like we, almost all of our life, it's like, you got five missiles. Well, fuck are you two? What happened? Drop? You die? Well, well, we got the Varia suit now. Oh wait, wasn't there a place the Chosen Oracle wanted us to go? There was something we needed to do. Was there? Yes, 
he wanted us to go. Where? What did that accomplish? Tell me. I think this. See, he sent us. Yeah. Oh wait, I, 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 I know, I, that's a seahorse. I thought that was the, uh, hmm. I, did you see like a hand too? Like did the seahorse look like a hand like creeping out of the lava? Where are we supposed to go? Hold on. There's, I believe, an area where it is yeah. a tunnel of hot. Oh, another another one of uh, the sat satanic rooms? Get out of yeah. the lava, please. Because apparently the Varya suit doesn't protect against that, which, you know, that sucks. At least the other kind of lava we're protected against. Apparently not the bubbly kind. Yeah, this kind we aren't. Yeah, see? Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, I remember this. Like, we couldn't get through. We're just like, no, we can push through. And we're, eventually we're just like, okay, no, this is stupid. This is a stupid idea. Uh, I think we might have to do this room next time on Spike hey, though. I don't think we can get through it with the time we have left. Right? Like, you want to just do it, you want to just do it next time? Let's do it next time. Fine. We'll do it next time on Splatcade. 